Hi, my name is Pritam Reddy from EC32. Project title code optimization and generator. We break our uh, video into four parts. Like uh, in the first part, we will discuss about basic understanding of the project. In second part, we will discuss about business case of our project. In fourth part, we will discuss about uh, in third part, we will discuss about typical users of the solution. Uh, like targeted audience like uh, users who are the users of our solution in fourth part we will discuss how the solution helps them like uh, how the solution helping the users who are using our website or uh, let's uh, let's deep dive into the understanding of the project so like uh, what project does the project is designed to help the users to generate the code and debug the code and it will also help to optimize the code and we can also review uh, review the code of the users. It will support multiple languages. Like we can select the uh, programming languages like Java, Python, Ruby, C++, Sha uh, C Sharp, and we can also select an uh, uh, Solidity language for writing a smart contract. Also, so the main functionalities of our project are code generator, code generation, debugging, review uh, reviewer code, optimization, and image upload and generate the code. In code generation, where the user will uh, just write its prompts and it will, uh, we can see here, he can, uh, he can select the uh, uh, time complexity, like uh, at which time complexity is expecting the solution. And he can also select the programming language in which we, he wants to code in. Uh, in which we, we want the uh, code to generate so he will get the code uh, code which appears like uh, which is uh, well optimized and uh, uh, which is readable and he can also uh, upload any image and he can select uh, time complexity and the programming language and generate image code so the uh, the the image uh, will be converted into the text and the text is giving uh, uh, text is given as a prompt to the llm the llm will generate the code uh, corresponding to it so we are using pytestract.exe to generate the image to text uh, i guess like uh, this is not only the standard one the basically we uh, basically we are about to not uh, we are not about to use an, any model to generate image to text so we are decided to use a python module called pytestract so we need to install pytestract.exe file in our computer and we need to mention its path to uh, uh, convert the image to text so these are our uh, main functionalities next we will uh, discuss about debugging so where uh, we can uh, we can debug our code like uh, in debugging option we can also debug our code like we, we need to paste our code and uh, we need to wait uh, wait for the debugging response and uh, similarly we can review our uh, review our code and we can also optimize our code and it's, uh, it is it will also give some suggestions and image upload and generate uh, generate the code we discussed a few few seconds uh, back so the tech stack is like obviously uh, front end we are using react and css uh, at the back end we are using python flask where uh, where the llm is operating the api requests will be sent to the uh, llm the llm will send the uh, response back to the front end where the front end will uh, uh, basically it display the uh information uh came from the back end basically we are talking about we are not deep diving into the code so in database we are using mongodb like uh, it will show the query and the response we also have a saved query option and uh, there are pre-trained model uh, like we are using a code llama 13 billion parameter instead guu q4 model uh, and to uh, image to test test rack for dot uh, exe to for the image to text conversions so these are the two models we are using in the back end for the uh, app uh, python app dot py to convert the uh, to convert the uh, image to text and uh, uh, and for uh, and we are using code lama as our main model to convert the uh, image uh, to convert the user prompts to uh, code so let's discuss about the business case the problem solved many developers struggles with writing an optimized code and debugging so like uh, uh, we designed our we designed our website like uh, website is like like uh, the structure is uh, the user will uh, the user will uh, enter any description or any prompt and he, he will get any the basic base code the basic code can be debugged debug and the basic code can be reviewed itself uh, re, uh, there it, uh, there itself it can be reviewed and uh, it can also be optimized there itself so this is the whole structure where the user will feel uh, very comfortable to very comfortable to uh, solve his problems in our website so the main business case are like uh, the traditional method for finding issues in the code or improving performance are time consuming required 
and how project help how project help uh, there will be time uh, time saving and cost reduction for uh, companies who use our website and uh, uh, using code optimization the improved uh, there will be improved in code quality so this address the many uh, many uh, developer struggles like uh, many developer struggles like me like um, uh, i'm the student who writes uh, who solves the lead code uh, day by day can use a uh, use my website for the better optimization and uh, uh, getting a correct review uh so like i need to pay like i uh so the basically the business case is if uh if the website is sold to any company the company should pay the uh, company should pay uh, the money to our website for the cost uh so uh so that time will be saving and the cost of the cost of the uh product will be also saved and the code quality will be also increased for the companies so these are the main business case of our project uh, let's discuss about like who are the uh, we, we get into the third phase like who are the like typical users of our solution so the mainly targeted audience are developers and development teams and software companies educational users like uh, but we mainly discuss about like uh, let's only discuss about like uh, any uh, any two of them like uh, for developers and students and learners uh, like for developers like uh, <laughs> like for developers like uh, the our website is useful like uh, helps uh, helps in solving the debugging uh, process and writing the code uh, very fast and it provide the real time optimization suggestion making the developer jobs developer job easy by performing immediate feedback and code quality performance so like it basically like uh, there itself it, the uh, developer can or uh, write his code uh, write his code uh, generate sorry generate his code and review its uh, review his code or else he can write any uh, in any other platform he can also review in our website for free uh, like for students and learners like uh, basically the students like me who's also the lead code day by day or a, a weekly or uh, weekly tries so need to know about this platform like where uh, where like a uh, student like me can review my code and debug my code and optimize my code like uh, to the extent and there uh, and our website will also give any suggestions uh, su uh, it will also give suggestions to the user like uh, how the code should be structured so so that i can learn more about the uh, coding uh, coding the uh, part like uh, any if there if there is any logic missing it will uh, it will say oh, okay bro like uh, in line number seven it's missing you are it's missing some something so i should cover uh, like in future i should learn uh, how the code structure should be look like so support learning by generating clean and optimized code example offering explanation for debugging results yeah we discussed about like uh, uh, it will explain the all debugging and it will also give the suggestions like how the code structure should be so these are the uh, so this um, so by this way it helps the users to uh, solve their problems uh, challenges and future improvements so the main challenges are like uh, and future improvements are basically we covered a lot of features like code optimization code generation and uh, debugging code review and image to conversion also like uh, is our pro uh, part of a project like where we uh, upload an image and we will get the code uh, according to it additionally i have an idea about like we have to uh, give a custom prompts like where the user you where the user will enter their uh, own prompts to solve their specific problem like if if, if i am the user of my website like i will enter my custom prompt and i will get any uh, response so the uh, backend server will save the all you uh, all the custom prompts and uh, it will uh, like uh, it will always evaluate the best prompt and it can use for their website like uh, uh pro like it's like prompt engineering it's but not exactly but like uh, it's collecting from the uh, best prompts from the users like it's the main idea but another area is code evaluation like where the users will paste their code and they will uh, get on marks based on uh some criteria like uh, time complexity space complexity and uh readability of an code like like this stuff so in based on certain country uh, criteria the users will get a certain score uh, out of 10 like this is the main idea and we also have an, uh, another idea like uh, the person like the user can the user will select any topic like uh, if the user will select a topic like recursion the our website will generate any any uh, 10 uh, 10 questions uh, 10 15 questions on the recursion to prepare up trip to prepare up for a, uh, for the interview like students like me in our college there is a press match every week on this friday so uh, like the main goal of our press match is to uh, strengthen your uh, weaknesses like strengthen your basics of and fund basic fundamentals of and computer 
uh, uh, computer science so like uh, dbms os like student will select an uh, any um uh topic about artificial intelligence like regression classification etc so this uh this uh, this website will help to uh help the uh, students to prepare for the interview like uh, it's not for the uh, larger extent but it for the basic extent like uh to strengthen their weaknesses so we discussed about uh how uh, we discussed about all three phases all four phases like uh, uh basic understanding of our project and the business case and typical users for our solution like uh, developers development teams and educational users and software companies and uh, how the solution helps the users for like uh, how like how it helps for the developers and how it helps for the students in different criteria and in different sectors uh, like uh, let's see our uh, website how it looks like so this is the main page of our code generator home a uh, home page saved query debug debug code optimization code review instructions are the uh, main features of our website and we can also submit the feedback to the team and this uh, this is how the optimization page looks like we need to paste the code and we need to press on the optimized code the code will be optimized code will be generated and this is how the um debugging page looks like and this is how the uh, code review looks like so like uh, uh, how the uh, see um like code uh, the base uh, like uh, uh, sample code review is the code is well written and easy to understand and uh, do string provides the clear descri uh, uh, description of what function does so this is uh, basically the main, uh, a code review of an uh, uh, sample test case uh, yeah thank you pretty complete